Hi, Serendipity students and members of the Ladybug class. Miss Carla here, and I have a couple of things to show you. Um, one very fun science experiment in particular. Um, a couple of weeks ago, the class, the Ladybug class, made these uh, oceans in a bottle by putting uh, some water, and I put some coloring in, some blue coloring, and some oil in, and it it when you swirl it around, it mixes together, makes it look like ocean waves. And one of my students on the Zoom class was very excited because he wanted to show me that he had gotten some Alka-Seltzer and he had put a part of an Alka-Seltzer tab in his and that it created a like sort of a lava lamp, which is very fun. And so I was going to uh, do that right here. Drop one in and you can see what happens. Some bubbles start to come up immediately, but it creates this lava lamp appearance. That's very fun to watch. And so when he was showing it to me on Zoom um, and I was admiring it, I was telling him that there is something, a trick that I do, and I use some old film canisters. Um, back several years ago, people didn't have phones that had cameras on them and you had to buy film at like the drugstore and put a spool of film inside your camera and take pictures and after you'd finished the whole roll of pictures you had to go back to the drugstore and get it developed and you had to wait like a week get your pictures back but the film always came in these little plastic canisters with a little cap so what I do with this experiment is I take a half of an Alka-Seltzer tablet, or I broke a little piece off of it, and I drop it into the water inside this film canister, and I put the cap on it, and I turn it upside down. And what happens is the Alka-Seltzer creates all these bubbles and gases inside the water, and because I've got a cap on it, there's no place for all of those gas bubbles to go. So what happens is the gas builds up and it creates pressure inside the little canister and pretty soon it can't hold the pressure anymore. Something's got to go. It pops off of the cap and it flies into the air. So unfortunately, you won't be able to see where it hits. You'll be able to see it fly up. But uh, it's pretty fun to watch an exciting uh, to see how long it's going to take before it explodes. Once it happens, I have to I have to put the tablet in the water and I have to get the cap on really quick and flip it into here. And almost, you know, within a moment, within a minute, it will blow up, okay? So here goes, wish me luck. Wow, that was really big, wasn't it? It hit my ceiling and bounced back and landed back on the table. So it's a lot of fun to do. I did it inside. Maybe if you have access to something like this that has a tight fitting lid, but a lid that will pop off, um, and some Alka-Seltzer, maybe you could do it outside. Make sure you stand back when you do it. Did you see how I leaned back? Because I didn't want to get hit by this. It was coming really fast. I hope you enjoyed this little experiment. I hope you enjoyed looking at the little lava lamp in the bottle. Those are fun things you can do at home. Have a great day. Bye-bye.